Buenas tardes, amigos! Today on Chef Andy, we are making flautas! Yes, it's true, we're making the famous flautas with the famous Teresa. Yes. This is her flauta recipe. Flauta, what does flauta mean? Flauta means it's for... It's like a flute. Like flute. We're gonna be teaching you how to play the flute. No, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna teach you how to cook a flute. And don't forget to flauta up that subscribe button if you aren't already part of our food movement here on the channel, guys. All right, so we have a boiling pot of water right now. We are going to put in our chicken and turn off our stove and let it sit for one hour. It's gonna cook in there for an hour. After an hour, we're gonna take out the chicken and let it rest for another hour until we get to our next step. So let's do that. Our chicken has been cooked for an hour and it has rested for an hour, so now it's time to break it up, right? Yes. So we wanna break it up into fine pieces, right? Like shreds. This part is the more difficult, the other part is like very easy. Yeah, I'd say the chicken in this whole recipe definitely takes the longest, but after you're done with the chicken, it's pretty, pretty, pretty quick, easy. right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, we're gonna tear up this chicken and we'll be back. All right, our chicken is all nice and shredded. Now we're just gonna add some pepper to it, some salt. Salt, a little bit of salt. And we Make took it. our corn tortillas and we put them in the microwave for about 30 seconds to heat them up, right? Yes. So why do you want them to be hot? Like, why do you want them to have because the heat? Because when it's like warm, not broken, let's not break it. Okay. And then make it soft. In so, the other case, it's like going to broke. So it, when you when you have your tortillas heated, they're not gonna rip as easy. Okay, so tortillas are hot. Now we need to add some canola oil to our skillet. We're using a skillet to cook this. We've got this on medium, medium high. Now you're gonna take your tortilla. You're gonna put the chicken right inside the tortilla. Then you're gonna roll up the tortilla. And then you're gonna take your toothpick and you're gonna put your toothpick right through the tortilla and then put it on this beautiful plate and wait make more. until we're gonna fry it. Can I try to make one, Teresa? Yes, you can do it. Okay, here goes Chef Andy. Okay, we got our tortilla, chicken, okay? Roll it. Roll it. Toothpick, is that good? Yes. Oh, look at that, Chef Andy, the first flauta. <laughs> All right, our flautas are looking fabuloso. Now it's time to cook them in our skillet. Yes. So we just plop them right in. Oh my goodness, these look amazing already. So Teresa, how much oil are we putting in this? It's putting like half a cup, but I think the, the best, the best is mm -hmm. one cup. So you want it to be in the pan, you want it to be like a couple centimeters? Yeah, dos or tres centimeters de aceite. Okay, and then you're ready to deep fry, baby. So how long does this take to cook? Five minutes, 10 minutes, depends on how much is the hot. How much heat, yeah. How much heat. Wow, you can already start to tell yeah. that it's starting to brown. Now, while Teresa is cooking the flautas, I'm gonna cut up some fresh lettuce. We have some beautiful romaine lettuce just into slices here. And this you can just put right over the flautas. All right, the flautas are done. Now we're gonna let them rest on this cookie sheet. And we also have some paper towels to soak up that excess oil. So we're gonna let these cool down. We're gonna put together our flautas. The flutes are ready, the flautas are ready. <laughs> okay, so we made some fresh guacamole, some pico de gallo, and then we yes. chopped up some romaine lettuce. Here's a plate, Teresa. And don't forget to take out your toothpicks. That's, that's really important, right? Yes. Okay, so I'm gonna go with the guacamole first. I'm gonna put a little pico de gallo, and then finish it off with some beautiful lettuce. Wow, this looks beautiful, beautiful. Teresa. Yeah, that's beautiful. Flauta, cheers. Cheers. Okay. Vámonos. Vámonos. It's too hot. You got that crunchiness from the corn tortilla because we deep fried it, that beautiful chicken, but then really, I think the guacamole and the mm. pico de gallo and, and then the lettuce on top, like, you know, hits this thing out of the ballpark for me. What about you? That's very good. Guacamole and, and pico de gallo and... It's like paired lettuce. perfectly. Yeah, it's perfect. Teresa, these are amazing. You're incredible. Thank you for being on the show again. Guys, if you wanna see more Teresa, leave in the comment section. If you wanna see more Mexican food, leave it in the comment section. And also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and slap a big like on the video. Teresa, anything to say to los Mexicanos or the people out there on YouTube? Pongan su dedo para arriba. 
And viva la México. Y viva México. Siempre soy mexicana y seguiré siendo. ¡Cómo! ¡Viva la raza! <laughs> <laughs> ¡Viva, ¡Viva la flauta! Well, another great meal. I hope you guys liked it. We'll see you next time in the kitchen. ¡Adiós, amigos! amigos.